Hey everybody, it's Dave Berman from DaveBermanCoaching.com with a Laughter Gym After Report for the Daily Laughers Facebook group and YouTube channel. And during this 15 minute laughter session, really actually right at the end of the laughter as our sort of bridge connecting us into the discussion part of Laughter Gym, we take just a few deep breaths where people are closing their eyes and relaxing and I'm making suggestions that are taking, taking advantage of, or really the better word is utilizing, because I don't mean to, uh, take advantage of like exploit, but utilizing the hypnotic nature of laughter. After 15 minutes of laughing, if we just close our eyes and take a few deep breaths, we're in a very receptive hypnotic state. This is a premise of laughnosis. And so what's just been happening more and more lately is I'm exploring without really thinking about how different ways of adding influence or suggestion to help people during those few deep breaths between the laughing and the conversation. And what fell out of the word hole this time <laughs> was some nonsense in a, in a way. It was like, you know, breathe in through your elbow, breathe out through your knees, breathe in through your ears, breathe out through your eyelids, and a, a couple of other things that I said that were kind of introducing confusion on purpose, which this is a, a hypnotic technique, but it wasn't showing up for me as a technique. It was just spontaneous, authentic expression, uh, creatively making this session new and different from previous sessions. That's just being in the moment for me. Um, and the utilization is like, just whatever's showing up, that gets incorporated into the experience. And so when we talked about what happened, how did you find yourself breathing that way, you know, and did you make sense of it? And, and seeing that it's okay to not try to make sense of everything, but just be aware, this is how it is. And one of the people talked about how that was very immediately her experience, that the mind got quiet because this confusion that I introduced on purpose, which is a bona fide hypnotic approach, especially for people who are analytic overthinkers, it gets past that part of the mind that's doing all that heavy duty thinking. So kind of everything made sense to me, um, as an experiment to explore and then to, to hear the feedback uh, that I got. And where it led us was, we say that neither energy nor matter can be created or destroyed. Matter and energy can neither be created nor destroyed. And I think sense is the same way. We can never create or destroy sense. We can never create sense. We can never make sense. <laughs> we don't have to try to make sense of everything. Just notice how it is. And laughter really is amazing at helping us make those kinds of observations. Just seeing things how they really are and letting it be as it is, with no need to change it, just allowing it to be. So if you'd like to explore your breath and sound with us in the laughter gym and see what it will reveal to you that's already there that you just don't always notice, look in the description or the comments for this video to see how to subscribe to the Principles of Laughter program. It will give you access to a huge library of laughter educational videos and classes and webinars and trainings and all sorts of things I've created over the last five years, as well as access to the daily laughter gym sessions. And I look forward to seeing you in there real soon. Thanks for watching.